commissioners. They have their own money that the commissioners don't have authority over. And this is a priority concern. And if your priority is just filling up jail beds so it's so you get a, a stable budget that way, and your priority is not enforcement, that's a challenge. It's a matter of priorities. And I would work with the sheriff to, hey, what are your priorities and how are you going to go about these, these um, property crimes and grows? It's not just grows. We've got, we've got property crime and violent crime that need to be addressed. The, by coming together as a community with, with the limited funds at the county level, if you come together with leadership and design and a plan, you can bring in foundations, you can bring in nonprofits, you can bring in um, individuals and businesses together to create a system where we take care of each other and the sheriff can then have his piece of it. And, and education is a part of that also. We have to come together. We have to do it together. The sheriff can't do it alone. The county can't do it alone. The, the people living out on the properties can't do it without the support. It takes leadership, and leadership only comes when you have vision and the able to draw people up, to get them to stand up and say, let's go.